Here is one little fish. Let's call him Bob. Bob lives in a pond. The pond is in Zambia, in southern Africa. But Bob is no ordinary little fish. Bob is a little fish with big ideas. Bob thinks any fin is possible. Let's find out more. Bob's pond belongs to Florence. When Florence became a widow, she struggled to grow enough food for herself and her two children. So she joined a group supported by one of CAFOD's local partners. The group members were trained to become fish farmers. I was interested in fish farming because it's a business that I knew would help me to make a living. Florence learned how to care for fish and make them grow. She dug two ponds. CAFOD's partner gave her some small starter fish. And soon, little fish had become big fish. Florence caught the fish, sold them, and used the money to buy some more starter fish. Life had begun to change, one fish at a time. Before long, Florence had set up a thriving business selling her fish. This meant she could provide for her family and send her children to school. But it didn't stop there. Florence shared her training with her neighbors. I saw how much the fish ponds helped me. So I helped a few people and they've also started their own fish ponds, just like me. So now there are lots of ponds in Florence's village. Florence's neighbors are using the money they earned from fish farming to support their children at school, to buy sustainable energy, to improve their homes, to connect with the world. In fact, Florence's village is officially transforming. People all over the world have big ideas, just like Bob and Florence. You can support CAFOD partners and help turn more little fish into big fish. To make a big difference in the lives of the poorest communities around the world. What will you do this Lent?